And now, live from New York, it's Sit and Be Fit with host Marianne Wilson. Hi, I'm Marianne Wilson. Come exercise with us in New York City's beautiful Central Park. Together, we'll be exercising in fun and effective ways to help you stay functionally fit and feel great. I had a great time today. I learned something else. I learned something better. I never, ever thought that you'd get such a workout sitting down. Live in New York, it's Sit and Be Fit. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Isn't this beautiful? I love New York. And we are live in New York, exercising with Sit and Be Fit. I want to get you in good alignment because that's one of the things I do best. Posture, learn to breathe, and then from there on, it's all fun, okay? So, as you're sitting in your chair, I want you to put your hands on your, I want you to sit on your hands. Can you feel those bones? They're there. Put, Lean on one bone, lean on the other. Now, go back and forth until you feel the most comfortable place, right on top of them. Now, I want you to stay there the whole time. Now, flatten out the tummy, lift up the rib cage, chin comes back, and the sternum gets lifted. Okay, there's one other thing I wanna help you with, and that's to learn how to breathe properly. When you breathe, I want you to relax this tummy. Relax it, relax it. Okay, I want it to expand when you take your breath in. Take a big breath in, let your belly expand. And then breathe out. Now pull that belly button in nice and tight. And relax again, big breath in. And breathe out, pull the belly button in nice and tight. Take your hands up to your ribs now. The next big breath that you take, I want it to expand your ribs. So put your hands here so you can feel your ribs expanding. Big breath. Ah, breathe out. That looks good. Another big breath of that fresh air. And slowly let it go. All right, we're going to start with a warm up. This is gently going to warm up some of your joints and get you started. Stay on those sits bones. Okay, here we go. Take a deep breath in and slowly breathe out. Now, put your hands right here and rock your pelvis forward and back. Now close your eyes and find the spot between forward and back that feels good. And then stay there and open your eyes. Good. Now put your hands right up here at the top and the bottom of your rib cage. Rock that rib cage only forward and back. And now close your eyes. Notice where it feels most comfortable. Open your eyes and give it a lift. Now touch the chin and pull it back. Now we're going to take a big breath. Let the belly expand, let's see it. And breathe out. Now I'm not the only one letting my belly expand, am I? Big breath in. And slowly breathe out. Now we're going to go right up here to your rib cage. Big breath in, let those ribs expand. Nice, and breathe out, very good. Let's do it one more time. Breath in, ribs expand. Nice, and breathe out. Now place your hands right here. We're going to start just sliding your hands down. Stay nice and tall. Now slide them a little farther so that your shoulder comes forward. Oh, can you feel that? Should feel good. going to touch the knee, open up your arm, reach back, touch this knee, open up and hold it there, look to your side, and now look straight ahead, just like you're posing for a picture, and let's change, start by touching the knee with this hand, open up, feel your chest opening, 
and then touch and open more and hold it there. Look to the side and now look straight ahead. Good work. Now we're going to go to some leg work. Start by touching the heel, toe, heel, and toe. And as you do that, move back and forth in your chair. There you go. Now, extend your leg and pull those toes back just a tiny bit. Then point and flex, point and flex. Okay, place that foot down, sit up tall, and now touch the heel and the toe. Heel and toe. Move forward and back in your chair. This is exercise, moving forward and back. And now we're going to extend your leg just getting a tiny little calf stretch, pulling the toes back, then pointing and flexing. Point and flex. One more. Now place that foot flat on the floor, lift up those ribs, and circle your ankle. Can you reverse that circle now? Make a big circle with your toes, like you're going over the numbers of a clock. Put that foot down and circle this one. Very good. Reverse. Now place your feet flat on the floor. Lift up your ribs. Push up and push back and push down. Very nice. We're going to go to the ball game now. And you know how um, the batter starts out. You know, he spits on his hands and then he rubs them together to warm them up. Well, we're not going to spit, but I want you just to blow. Okay, there you go. Now, get your favorite bat. Feel that range of motion all through your torso. Let's change. This is a lefty here. Okay, time to let go of that bat and root for that team. Woo! <laughs> Good job. Okay, looks like he didn't make it. It's one, two, three strikes. They're out. Okay, too bad. Next batter up. Okay, pick up that favorite bat now. Get as much range of motion through your uh, chest. There you go. And lefty. <laughs> Time to root for that team. Okay. Yankees? Mets? Okay, sorry. One, two, three strikes. They're out. Okay, the game's going on a little bit, and now our team had a hit. So they're going to run the bases, and we're going to run kind of funny with one leg at a time. Okay, here we go. You want to look over your shoulder and make sure uh, somebody's not throwing that ball to get you out. Good job. Okay, let's give this leg a workout now. Look over your shoulder, make sure everything's clear back there. How are you doing? You feel okay? Good job. Okay, now here's the person in the outfield. He's catching here and here and to the side here and here. Oh, there's one way up there and up there. Wow, what do you know about that? I think he's safe and that's a home run. <laughs> Good job, everybody. Um, we're going to start out by placing your hand right here under your chin and turning your head to one side and then the other. OK, 
Okay, now it's time to lift those shoulders one at a time and then roll and push back. Lift, lift, roll, push it back. Lift, lift, roll, push back. Hands on your hips. Look over the shoulder and then lift it up twice. Look over this shoulder, lift twice. And this shoulder, lift. And this shoulder, lift. Okay, hold your elbow and give it a little swing. Give it a lift. And change. Swing it first. And lift next. Now you're going to put your hand on your shoulder and comb your hair. Do it again. Slide it over and let's change. Slide all the way over. Slide and over. Now, one arm up and the other arm. This is external rotation for your shoulder. Okay, now we're going to take both hands to this side and turn your palms up, down, up and down, all the way up on the other side. Up, down, up, down, all the way up. Up, down, up, down. Last time. Now, put your hands right here. We're going to do some footwork now. This leg is going to go in front and to the side four times. Or maybe more. <laughs> more. <laughs> now, take it behind. Have to move that other foot out of the way. And change legs, front first. And now behind, whoo! Okay, let's give your arms a rest. And we're going to slow it down. And we're going to take it front, side, back and side. Okay, here we go. Front, side, back and side. Front, side, back and side. Keep going. Move side to side in your chair. Remember, that's an exercise. Now change legs. Front, side, back, and side. Front, side, back, and side. Front, side, back, and finish. Woo! Okay, good job. <laughs> you, you follow beautifully. Okay, um, I know everybody knows Alexander's Ragtime Band and those wonderful, that, that wonderful era, beautiful music. We're going to work a little bit of fingers, a um, little more of the legs. And so sit up tall. Are you still on those sits bones? Whoop, up, up, up. <laughs> there you go. All right. We're going to start by touching your chin and pulling it back away from your hand. Let's look over the shoulder. And look over this shoulder. And look over the shoulder again. And this shoulder. Okay. Now, tilt your ear toward your shoulder. Back up and tilt to this shoulder. And back up. Now look down at your knees. Look up at the sky. And now straight ahead, press your toe and dig your heel. And notice you're moving forward and back in that chair. Here comes your change. Take that foot side to side. And now circle. Change legs, press the toe, dig the heel, press and dig. Okay, take that foot side to side and circle. 
Now we're going to walk up the shin with this leg. One, two, three, four, and back down. And up here, two, three, four. You need that movement to get your socks and shoes on in the morning. Put your heel on your toe. Lift that top foot with the bottom foot, keeping your heel on the floor. Good job. Perfect. Now let's change legs. This foot's flat, this heel is on top, and lift, lift. Good job. Okay, now we're going to do some finger work. Your thumb is going to do all the work at first. It's going to cross the index finger four times. Okay, let's do it now. One, two, three, Four. Next finger, thumb goes across, and next finger. This is the ring finger. The thumb is doing all the work here. And now the little finger. Okay, time to give those fingers some work to do. Ready? Index finger slides down and up the thumb, just like a sliding board. And change. Next finger. And next. And now the little finger. That's hard, isn't it? That's the hardest one for me. Okay. Shake it out. Now, we're going to reach up with one arm. Up, down. And give it a good stretch. The other side, up, down, and stretch, and again, up, down, stretch, up, down, stretch, up, down, stretch. Good job. Now reach forward, pull back, squeeze those shoulder blades, and relax. Reach, pull it back, and give it a good squeeze. And again, reach, pull back. Can you do it one more time? Reach forward, pull it back, squeeze, and finish. Woo! Good job, everybody. Okay, we're going to work a little bit more on the finger joints. And also, did you know that patting certain parts of the body actually stimulates certain parts of the brain? So. It works together, but we'll start by sitting up tall on your sits bones and circling the wrists. And you can use your shoulders. Take it up, and then reverse the circle and bring it down. And up again. Easy, easy. And down. One more. Bring it down. Okay. Stretch, close. Stretch and close. Stretch, close. Turn the palms down. Now we're going to comb our hair from front to back. Front to back. Notice how you move your upper body as you do that. Good range of motion. And after this next one, we're going to start with some finger exercises. Start with your index finger and your thumb, and you're going to make a circle twice. And then straighten those fingers and tap four times, a little faster. Okay, one, two, Three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, let's do it this way. One, two, tap. One, two, three, four, tap. Two, one, two, three, four, tap. Two, one, two, three, four. Okay, do it all again. Tap with a circle, then straight finger. Fast, circle. Next finger.
Good job. Now shake it out. Here's another hand movement. It's probably a movement that works every muscle in your hand. Start with the fingers pointing up. Straight. Now make a flat table. Now make a hook. Slide the fingers down and then back up. We'll do it all again. Remember, if it hurts, don't do it. Straight, flat table, make a hook, down and out. Wiggle it out. One more set. Straight up, flat table, hook, down and out. Okay, time to pack. One, two, one, two, three, four, one. One, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, ribs, one, two, one, two, one, two. Woo! Good work. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have Gretchen come join me now. And if anyone would like to stay seated, follow Gretchen. If you want to stand, then you follow me. We're going to do the Mexican hat dance now. Now remember, lots of hips, okay? Lots of loosening up. <laughs> okay, so you want to stand on this foot, check your posture, take the hand and knee out and in. Change. Change, out and in. Change one more time. And then we're going to do a one, two, three, and tap two. One, two, three, tap two. One, two, three, tap two. One, two, three, tap two. There are a lot of these. Keep going. One, two, three, tap, two. Okay, here comes your change. You're going to step out, away from your partner, and back in. Step away and back in. Step away and back in. Now bend both knees and up on the toes. Step away again. Back in. How's your partner doing? <laughs> Is he doing good? Step away and back in. Now bend both knees and up on the toes. Feet shoulder width apart and bump the hips to this side and change. Okay, here comes a change. Step front, front. Now step back. Okay, step back again. <laughs> Okay, now it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, kick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, kick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, whoop. Whoop. Okay. Change. Walk four.
One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, very nice. Thank you so much. Keep reaching out for a better day. I'm Marianne Wilson. Please. Welcome to two. Those are good too. Really? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Let me do it one more time. Join me weekdays on. I don't know how old you are, but I, I, I'm already <laughs> exhausted. <laughs>